welcome back everybody it's another tuesday which means it's time for another video from my series star trek the official starships collection in which i talk about different uh, models released by eagle moss this video will be about issue 80 from the end of august 2016 and it's uh, the federation mission scout ship from the movie Star Trek Insurrection. Now it arrived in a neat little paper bag almost a year ago and it looks like this. This is of course the magazine and this is the model itself. In that wonderful bubble wrap now this is the box containing the model on this side you have the information that this is a collector's model and it's not designed or intended for play by children under 14 years of age published by eagle moss ltd made in china on this side you can see the logo of the original star trek tv show from the 1960s here you can see the logos of star trek the next generation deep space 9 a dirty logo of Star Trek Voyager and Star Trek Enterprise. On the bottom you can see it's StarTrek.com, trademark and copyright 2016 by CBS Studios Incorporated, which is the company which right now owns the Star Trek franchise. And this is the model. You can see it's a typical federation design and it has some nice hull detail plus some interesting uh, paint job. You can see the registry number on both of the wings NCC 75227 just like on the sides. There is the nice little hatch on the top windows again NCC 75227 the engines and on the bottom you can again see on the wings the registry number NCC 75227 so now let's talk a bit about more detailed information from the top view those were information about different parts of the ship from the top now detailed information about the ship from the side view detailed information from the front you can see that there is this photon torpedo launcher in the front all these information can be found in the middle of the magazine which i will be looking at in a few moments now the last side detailed information from the back you can see the impulse engines and the rear phaser strip. So, this is the model from the back, and there are no detailed information about the bottom part. So, let's distract you for a moment while I bring out other parts the stand you can see here it's Starfleet scout ship trademark and copyright 2016 CBS Studios Incorporated
and let's put all the things together. You can see it's a bit wobbly. As many other models released by Eagle Moss. And it almost falls down, which is one of the reasons why I don't have it on display, but still in the box. But otherwise than that, I think it's a nice representation of the ship used in Star Trek Insurrection. So this was the model and as I said every model comes with this uh, nice little magazine. This is the magazine belonging to issue 80. Federation Mission Scout ship from the 24th century. Now, the magazine begins with the table of content, instructions for the assembly and Federation mission scout ship specification. It's a one pilot plus five to ten passenger ship from the 24th century. Now here we have an article about the Federation Mission Scout ship with a nice picture of the actual ship and a little picture from the movie in which it was used, Star Trek Insurrection. More pictures from Star Trek Insurrection. Now, these two pages are the main source about the detailed information about the different parts of the ship, which I used for the images you have seen a few moments ago. The colors this time seem to be the same on both the model and the pictures, which is pretty rare if you have seen my previous videos. which is a good thing. And now my favorite part of every magazine, designing the ship and filming. It was created by John Eves, the famous illustrator or famous if you are one of the people who watch the end credits in the TV shows and movies. Star Trek Insurrection Production Diary, a wonderful picture of the village, which was uh, created by Mr. Herman Zimmerman. That was the Baku village. This is Mr. Herman Zimmerman. I don't really know what this thing is in the background of the conference room. This is the location on which the movie was shot, a little model of the village. And the actual village which was built. More pictures from Star Trek Insurrection. Definitely not a fan favorite movie, but I still think it's much better than Nemesis or the reboot movies. Wonderful behind the scenes photographs. On-screen appearances 
this ship was used only in Star Trek Insurrection. Movie number nine. And next week I am going to talk about issue 81. Oh, there is a brief mentioning of a deleted scene by which had Quark from Deep Space Nine. And issue 81 will be the Zindi Warship. So, thank you very much for watching. That's it for today. Hope you like these little Eagle Moss review videos. I'm doing them every Tuesday. And I now came to August 2016, which means that I'm slowly getting to the current releases. So feel free to watch any of the previous videos on my channel. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button and see you next week. Thank you very much again and bye.